foreign domestic workers, like in Hong Kong and Singapore, will be coming to South Korea in the second half of this year. The South Korean government announced the reform plan for employment permits in December of last year, stating its intention to allow foreign employment in the household and care sectors through a pilot program. The Ministry of Employment and Labor plans to grant employment permits only to those who have been certified for Korean language proficiency. Foreign domestic workers will be able to work only through certified domestic service providers, designated by the Ministry of Employment and Labor. The certified providers will bring foreign domestic workers into the country and supply them to the clients in need. Service contracts will be signed between the users and the certified providers, while employment contracts will be signed between the providers and the workers. South Korea applies domestic labor laws to foreign workers who have obtained employment permits. The main laws that apply include the Labor Standards Act and the Minimum Wage Act. Therefore, employers must pay wages that are at least equal to or higher than the minimum wage, which is currently $7.30 per hour or around $1,520 per month. Overtime and holiday work require additional legal allowances to be paid. Paid holidays and annual leave are also provided. Many Korean women are concerned about their husbands having extramarital affairs with foreign domestic workers.